what is up viewers we're streaming we're back we're in for a very anxiety written day very anxiety written day this is not gonna be a fun day at least for me <laughs> for the islanders this is not gonna be a fun day <laughs> Hell no. Uh, for some fans, it's not gonna be a fun day. For some fans, uh, they're gonna be chilling. They're gonna be laying back. They're gonna be eating the popcorn. Like, I know Penguins fans are happy. And guys, I have a surprise for you today. To make sure this is extra cool, so we're all updated. I did some, I was working hard last night. Uh, Jordan Addy's probably not gonna be in here. He's probably working right now. But I was working hard for you guys last night. And BAM! We got this today. <laughs> I was working for you guys last night. Let me know if I have to make it any bigger. I can make this bigger for you guys if you think it should be bigger on the screen. So I have a lot of uh, UFAs down below here uh, of... <laughs> yes, Jordan Addy. Uh, so I have a lot of UFAs down here. Let me know if there's any UFAs I've left out. Um... Uh, if there's any names where you're like, oh my god, you know, like, you should, like, definitely, you know, put him in. Jake, uh, Campbell's already an oiler? Oh, you think, oh, you think he's going to be an oiler. Oh, yeah. I've seen a lot of things where they, you, yeah, I think they've already said Campbell's definitely going to be an oiler. Like, that's just, like, a done deal. Yeah, Campbell, uh, Johnny Goudreau is gonna be in a, Malkin has already signed. I have that up there. Uh, Kadri, maybe he's, maybe he's an av again. We'll see. Giroux, uh, Ottawa Senator? Don't know. But there's, there's so many, like, uh, uh, Kemper is most likely going to the Capitals, things like that. Trojek to the Rags. I did see them going hard for Trojek. Hey, Jordan. Yes. Uh, Jordan's the one who told me about Trojek. Yes. <laughs> Crosby got on his knees and probably begged Malkin to- There you go. See, Malkin there. Pittsburgh, four times 6.1 AAV. So you guys, once the, um, once the signings start coming in, I will be updating this down below. So this is what I'm going to be doing. And just different things. Uh, Burakovsky, where is he gonna go? Strom, where is he gonna go? Peron, uh, oh, I think I have Trochik in there twice, actually. Hold on. I'm going to have to fix that. I think I have Trojek in there twice. I do. Let me fix that. Okay, I fixed it. Tampa's finished not doing anything. Well, Andre Palat's going to be going, so let's see. <laughs> Obviously, Evander Kane signed last night at 2 a.m. Couldn't have picked a better time myself. <laughs> but yeah, Evander Kane signed again with Edmonton. Yay. Uh, hey, Jordan, there he is. Uh, so yeah, he helped me last night. Well, he I kind of did it myself, but yeah, he kind of gets credit. <laughs> Don't see anything with Andrew Gross. Um, yeah, no, we're not going to see anything yet until 12 nothing's gonna no news is gonna drop until that 12 o'clock mark so don't expect anything i know it's not nfa but stay away from jt miller church of pedersen that's funny because a lot of canucks fans i've seen want people to go towards jt miller that the canucks want a deal that canucks fans want a deal for jt miller they want to get a package for jt miller um and because of what went down at the draft they're worried now that nothing's going to happen. What happened from what I can confer is the New York Islanders and the Canucks had a deal for JT Miller. But what happened right before it went down, the Canucks said, we want it. We want an extra package for him. Like an Atu Ratu or something. And Lou said, no, go F yourself. <laughs> And so Lou turned around, went to the Habs, who probably went to him, and he said, All right, let's get Romanov. <laughs> kind of like an F you to the Canucks. So that's why, because we saw all these rumblings, oh, JT Miller, JT Miller. So when they went up 
And they were like, we have a trade, Montreal. And we were like, oh, I guess this is the second trade. And then they said to the New York Islanders, my brother and I looked at each other. We were like, what? <laughs> we were like, what? We were like, we thought we had to deal with the Canucks. Like, so that's why, like, we're not mad about Romanov. Like, Montreal fans get that very mixed up. We're not mad about Romanov. Like, I am very happy about Romanov. And the uh, Montreal's pick got us Isaiah George, which I'm very happy about that pick. Because Montreal's trade was the gift that kept on giving, because they gave us Isaiah George. So, but the th why we were so, like, sh shell-shocked about it was because everything said... We were getting JT Miller. Canucks, 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 JT Miller, JT Canucks, Canucks. So when we're sitting there going, oh, we know this trade. Like when a freaking Batman goes up there and they're like, oh, we got a trade. We're like, oh, we know what it is. We we know what to expect. And he goes, trade between Montreal and the Islanders. We were like, what the F? We were like, Thomas with the 10. Let's go, Thomas. He says, what was Dobson's qualifying offer? I saw they got qualifying offers. I didn't see the value on them. I did not see the value on their qualifying offers. I will look now for you, though. Dobson Q QO. There is nothing about the value of Dobson's qualifying offer. I'm telling you now. There was nothing about his value. By the way, do you guys like the, uh, I have new dono, new dono gifts. I hope you like them. <laughs> I have new dono gifts. I have new sub gifts because guys, we needed to change them up. As you know, the donos were of Barry Trotz and the subs were of <laughs> Jordan Eberly and Anders Lee. They needed to be changed. <laughs> so... We got new sub gifts and we have new dono gifts. So I hope you enjoy them. I, w I told you I was working last night. I, w I was working to change stuff. And so I'm like so excited about that. But thank you, Thomas. But there was nothing that I saw about who... I, I saw that Dobson, Romanoff, Fellows, Durando, and Wotherspoon all received qualifying offers. But there was nothing about who what the qualifying offers were nothing that i saw at least you feel like dylan strom will go to the oilers interesting dylan strom is a wild card in this one like if we got dylan strom i wouldn't be upset but dylan strom is definitely a wild card in this he is a big wild card am i ready to be disappointed aren't i ever with this damn team aren't i ever <laughs> Hold on. Where's Snorlax? Hold on. My buddy. Hold on. He's not in position. There we go. Alright. <laughs> My buddy was not in position. Okay. I gotta get him like a little Islanders jersey. <laughs> Yo, imagine. Imagine I get him like a little Islanders jersey. Yeah. <laughs> that would be so sick. Hey, Wonder. What's up? Burns to the Canes! Oh. Burns to the Canes! So, Brent Burns does leave San Jose. But it's to the Carolina Hurricanes. Obviously, they lost Tony D'Angelo. They were looking for someone to cover that spot. I was not thinking Brent Burns! What? Here the Carolina Hurricanes are close to acquiring Brent Burns. It says that he must agree to the trade. I don't see anything about him. Oh, here we go. Here it is. Here it is. A rookie GM moved Brent Burns contract. Chuckles can't even move can't even move one year of JVR. <laughs> Interesting. That's gonna be really weird. I mean, he had 54 points. It's not like he was awful. 
Did I see about Samsonov? I did not. Leaf sign giant. Like, I'm sorry if I'm like on my phone, but this is literally how I'm going to be getting my news. Brent Burns, no movement clause is the only thing holding back a trade to the Canes. Hmm. Josh Manson, of course, was re-signed with the Avalanche. Samsonov is going to the Leafs. Dakota, if I'm streaming, why would I raid HTH? Listen, HTH is my buddy, but you raid someone at the end of a stream. That's the only problem. <laughs> Connor Brown traded to Edmonton. I can't even keep up. Trade New Jersey? Hold on, I just... New Jersey Devils acquire acquire Eric Hola from the New, from Bruins for Pavel Zaka. What? No way! Is this real? Oh my god. One for one. Devils acquire Hala and Bruins get Zaka. Bro. What? Don Sweeney, please. Bro, I just saw it now. I just saw this now. Oh my god. Don Sweeney! Wow. I can't believe that. There's so much to catch up on with you guys. Sorry, I was preparing for the stream, so I'm catching up. Yeah, Brent Burns to Carolina. That, I, what, the even F. With Zaka going to the bro, the bro, what? 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 Pasta leaving next year, says Dakota. You think Giroux is close to going to the Senators? Yeah, that's that's the chatter is that he's gonna be us going. Going, uh, uh, it was sent to me, like, the all that the Panthers could offer him was, like, league minimum. Like, they offered him, like, one year, one mil. I can imagine being, like, Claude Giroux and, like, looking up at them, like, really? Bob McKenzie confirmed it? How can he confirm crap? When did Bob McKenzie confirm that? There's no way he can confirm it unless he saw the contract. Oh, there's a few players involved in the Carolina San Jose trade that's in the works, not just Burns. So we gotta wait on that. Looks like Kane, Kane and Taves are staying in Chicago. 
What's up, man? It's not even 12 o'clock yet, and I can't even keep up. <laughs> Pens do something? They already did something with Monken. <laughs> I thought Kane would go to the ranger solely for the fact that he has more cap drivers to punch. How am I today? Nervous. Anxious. And I'm just ready. I'm ready for the impending storm that is my fan base to just gripe about anything we do. <laughs> Thoughts on the Romanov trade? I like it. I like it. I'm honestly, you know what? Because, like, after the draft, that 13th pick is, like, useless. So, you might as well go for it. JT Miller, I wasn't too ecstatic on. I mean, J I, I didn't know how to feel about JT Miller. Romanov, though, you get a young defenseman, which we needed. In the first place. We needed a defenseman. Because I don't know what's happening with Andy Green. I don't know what's happening with Chara. So we need that defenseman in the back. I think he's going to be perfect with someone like Adabi. He's he's talented. I think we can, uh, you know, ignite his uh, scoring side back. And you know what? When you look at the Montreal fan base, he's, he, and he's, he's physical. He's talented. He's a puck mover. That's something we've been missing in the back is a puck moving defenseman. I think he's a great acquisition, honestly. I like him. And yes, and the third round pick gave us Isaiah George. So I'm not mad about it. I really, I think it was a great trade. Um, where do I think Mikheyev will end up? That's something interesting too, Matthew. I actually texted Addy. I don't even know if Addy got back to me about Mikheyev. And Victor Olofsson has re-signed with the Buffalo Sabres. Two year, 4.75. Uh, cause, uh, I know he was a, a person of interest for Islanders kind of thing with, uh, Mikheyev. He says, this is definitely a, has, he's, has speed to burn. Nine times out of ten, he can't finish on a breakaway. <laughs> he's a young kid. I mean, he's a young kid. What was his first year? Like, 2019 was, uh, Mikheyev's first year. But, he's, he could be a person of interest. What do I think Lou's p plan will be? What do you think Lou's plan will be? Can, can anyone tell me what Lou's plan will be? If you know Lou's plan, please come to me. Like, if you have that inside knowledge, oh, please whisper it in my ear. Like, mm, I, the only thing I've heard about Lou's plan is Goudreau. The, the only thing I've possibly heard of what a, a Lou Lamorello plan is, is Goudreau. And if we don't get Lou, Goudreau, trade for Tarasenko. I heard like, Tarasenko was our plan B, like, to trade for Tar Tarasenko. So... Addy says we should stay away from Mikhail. Oh, ooh, okay. He's gonna get overpaid, okay? But yeah, Olofsson re-signed with the Sabres. I know a lot of Sabres fans are taking a deep breath right now. We got the coffee going. We got the coffee going. This is not sponsored by Duncan. We got an extra shot of espresso in here. I don't know if you can see this. Yo, I don't know if you can see this. Add shot of espresso. Yes. Yes, ma'am. It's the only way to do it. Could Lou troll for pulp a trade for pasta? No. <laughs> yeah, that would be insane. Tarasenko would be insane. Maybe. I think maybe. He, I mean, he's up there in age, but... Maybe. Get... <laughs> trade Bailey. Trade... <laughs> Yo, imagine we somehow were able to trade Bailey for Tarasenko or some shit. <laughs> Imagine we were able to like dumb fleece that shit or something like oh my god <laughs> I would I would lose my my crap <laughs> oh. But honestly like this is this is I wanna see it happen. I wanna see where these these free agents go. I wanna see it done. 
Oh, yeah, no, Eli, I know. I mean, if anything, this last season proved he still got it. You know, he still got it. Pasta has beef with Sweeney, so I don't know. But he's still getting paid, so... But you know what I mean? Like, he's still under contract with Sweeney, so it's... Maybe after this next year, you know, we'll see, but... He's still under contract with Sweeney, and Sweeney still has the final word. So it's not like it's like Pasta has the final word here. He does not. The Blues are expected to sign Thomas Grice as their backup goaltender. So Thomas Grice looking to go to St. Louis. And of course everyone's saying he's garbage. So's Detroit. <laughs> Joseph, did you see what they wanted? They wanted Dobson for Tarasenko. How big of a mistake would have that been, Joseph? Another Devon Taves on our hands. Hell no. I don't care how much we needed a scorer. They ain't, they're not taking Dobson. I'd love to steal Ryan Strom from the... No. Michael, we had Ryan Strom, Michael. Right, and Michael T. We have Ryan Strom. Number one, he can't finish. Dude can't finish. I don't know if he has any kids because he dude can't finish. <sighs> and we had Ryan Strom, and he was. I remember when the Rangers got him, and I was kind of laughing because I, I hated him on the Islanders. <sighs> no. <sighs> Dylan Strom, maybe. If uh, Dylan Strom, maybe. Ryan, no. <sighs> Michael T, you would think that, but no, it don't, it doesn't matter, dude, dude could be playing up there with Panarin and he couldn't finish, okay, no, <laughs> putting it out there, and you know what, the sad part is Ranger fans will agree with me, okay, uh, no, <laughs> Uh, see, see, Addy's even comparing him to Ilya Mikheyev, okay? <laughs> I'm setting my expectations low. I'm a veteran Islanders fan, Michael T says. I feel that. And you know what? I'm still young, and I'm still setting my expectations so high today. And I know they're just going to be so crushed. I know that, listen... Jo His name is Johnny Goudreau. Where have I seen a player before whose name is Johnny who wanted to go play for his hometown team? <laughs> I know he's going to New Jersey, bro. I know he's going to New Jersey. And it kills me. <laughs> like, I know it. I know it's happening. Grace to the Blues. Is it official? No, it can't be official yet. It's not free agency time. Well, I know he. I just announced it before Dakota. Kim, I don't want the Isles to grab. <laughs> oh, damn, Addy. Jeez, you really do not like Kev. <laughs> oh my gosh, Addy, where is Phil Kessel going? Wow, Jordan says I would want Grice as a backup. And you know what? That's the thing. People undervalue Thomas Grice because of the team he was on. I'm just saying it now. I think people are undervaluing Grice because of the defense that was in front of him. I'm saying it now. I really do think so. I think if he played plays more with the Blues, he people will see him better personal opinion but um i don't know how much he's gonna sign for with the blues but it seems pretty one and done he's going to be with the st louis blues i 
I think we might trade Varlamov and Mayfield today. Varlamov isn't going anywhere. Um, Lou has already said that. He's not breaking up the tandem of Sorokin and Varlamov. Um, there's a dynamic there he does not want to break up. Mayfield? I haven't heard anything about getting rid of Mayfield. I don't see why, especially since we've been needing defense. Six minutes until disappointment. Yeah! Six minutes. <laughs> Alexa, here, here we go, ready? Set, Alexa, set alarm for 11.59 a.m. Alarm set for 11.59 a.m. We're getting ready. <laughs> Alexa, volume up. Would you uh, like the volume up even more? Yes. <laughs> we getting ready. Oh, we getting ready. We're, we're getting that countdown. Ready. Alexa, set alarm for 12 p.m. Second alarm set for noon. We getting ready. We getting ready. <laughs> Woo! Someone asked me what type of player is Grice. Someone asked me what type of player is Thomas Grice. I, I said he's a wonderful person and goaltender who really puts in his all when he plays. He feeds off the crowd. I would say, like, never under- he's German. Really. I've met him in person before too. One of my favorite, what, what's the source? What do you mean? What's the source? Do Johnny Goudreau and Barzell have any playing time together? Against each other on the ice. <laughs> uh, that's the only time they have playing time together. Um, uh, Okay. Would I want line A? I mean, who wouldn't want line A? <laughs> Patrick line A, the man with the, who needs a toupee. I'm <laughs> Patrick line A. I'm trying to think if I would want a Patrick line A. Like how he would fit up in our dynamic. Joseph says, why not? Because it's also like, Patrick Liney is just a center, right? He's not a winger, right? Forget. Keep it up? He, is he a winger? Yeah, he's a winger. Okay. I forget. <coughs> <coughs> Guys, excuse me if I'm coughing today. Oh my god, it's already 11.59. Holy crap. Alexa. Off. Sorry, I got caught up. <coughs> Excuse me if I'm coughing today. I'm getting over a chest cold. Him and Maddie Barzell would be pretty dope, honestly. 
I'm getting over a chest cold. Um, that's why I haven't been making videos. That's why I haven't done anything about the draft. Um, or anything, because I've been sick. I'm, I'm <coughs> trying to get over it. I was doing so well, too. Uh, I've been getting over a chest cold. So that's why I haven't been, uh, doing these. But, um, for free agency, I was feeling a little better. And I said, screw it. I'm gonna, I'm gonna do this. So, uh, if I'm coughing, please, um, leave me be. The Sharks are interested in Lynn Blum, who the Flyers are buying out. It is 12 o'clock! Free agency time! Alexa, off. It is free agency time! <sighs> Campbell signs with the Edmonton Oilers! As we were predicting, Campbell already has signed! Five by five! So I gotta find Campbell. Samsonov to the Leafs! One... One times 1.8! 1 I'm gonna add Samsonov. One point eight AAV. Okay, and it's Samsonov. It is oh, it is Giroux to the Ottawa Senators. Three years, six point five. So Giroux will be going to the Senators, 3 times 6.5. It is coming fast. Whew. But Campbell got the, the contract he wanted. Campbell got that contract he wanted. T Tampa Bay Lightning and Ian Cole. One year, three. Ian Cole going to the Tampa Bay Lightning. Ian Cole going to the Tampa Bay Lightning. Woo! For one year, three million. I'm going as fast as I can, guys. So, the Tampa Bay Lightning will be getting Ian Cole to a 1 times 3. Yep, G Giroud to Ottawa is done. Whew, I'm just refresh, refresh, refresh. Sons of Liberty says three mil for Ian Cole, LMAO. <laughs> Flyers and Devils out on Goudreau. Well, yeah, of course they're going out on Goudreau. Hopefully we are too. Hopefully Lou is already on that phone going, Hey Johnny, how you doing, bro? Like, <sighs> 
Oh, I just had a heart attack. Dr Devils and Brendan Smith have agreed to two year 1.1 mil. I just saw New Jersey Devils and I went, <laughs> I'm okay. I'm okay. I'm okay. I just saw this and I just had a heart attack. Like, oh, okay. Oh. Oh my god. Yo, 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 Jimmy, what's up? <laughs> if you know HT8, that's, that's an inside joke, bro. <laughs> oh my gosh. Uh, by the way, if you want the uh, speed on the bottom to go a little bit faster, let me know. Because there's a lot of names. If you want it to go a little bit faster, let me know. Because I can speed it up. Samsonov with the 1.1.8. 1 times 1.8. And then I saw this, apparently, I saw like this fake report that John Goudreau turned down a $10.2 million deal with the Devils. I don't know how true that is. God, I hate this. I hate this so much. I'm like, I'm like schwitzing. I'm schwitzing right now. Oh. More coffee. More coffee. More happy. Oh. Mikhaev? I have no idea where Mikhaev will go. He's another wild card. Refresh, 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 refresh. Oh, by the way, how do you guys like my new uh, pop socket? He matches my buddy. <laughs> how you guys like the new pop socket? <laughs> yes, I. It's already uh down here, right there. It's literally crossing as we're talking, right there. The Samsonov deal is right there. Right there. Don't like the lightning pick? Their uh, draft pick? Is Snorlax one of my favorite Pokemons? Yes. <laughs> it absolutely is. Uh, can we... As we wait, it's to see if the Kane Sharks gets to finish... Gets to the finish line on a Brent Burden's trade. Some San Jose players are surprised it's surprised it's actually happening. Ooh! Some of the San Jose Sharks players are shocked that this is actually in the talks right now. From David Pagnota. David Pagnota is like, what is happening? Ian Cole, not good. Oh, okay. So you're not happy with them acquiring Ian Cole. Okay. I feels. Oh my god. Oh, what's this? Source. Flyers not willing to deal number one pick to move J JVR. Interesting. Hey, Justin Schultz to Seattle. Two times three. Two times three. Ish, says Elliot Friedman. What are your thoughts? Ian Cole. I mean, it's one year deal. So it's kind of, it's just like a, it's just like a trial, honestly. I, I wouldn't be, I'm not too pissed at it. It's a one year deal. See what happens with it. Like, if it was three years, maybe. It's a one-year deal. But Justin Schultz to Seattle. I 
don't think we got any Kraken fans in here. I'm gonna bet two times three. For now. I love how, like, I post- I posted that for funsies on Twitter, like, I saw New Jersey Devils and had a heart attack, like, thing, and he go- and some people are like, it's not happening, Kim. I'm like, let me have fun. Like, some people are so- like, I understand, like, you don't want to get hurt, but, like, then you lose out on the fun of free agency day. Like, honestly, can we agree with that? Like, if you don't give in to, like, the hope, you lose out on the fun of free agency day. Like, then you have no fun. This Johnny Hockey crap might be prolonged. He might sign with someone a month from now. <laughs> I I doubt I doubt it would take I don't know. I wouldn't mind Johnny Hockey. Who would mind Johnny Hockey? Good uh, good upside signing there. It's one year 1.8 for Samsonov with the Maple Leafs, I know. Hey, what's up, McDavid? Uh Edmonton doing some signings. Uh you guys just got Campbell for five five and five and evander kane that's all uh coming on this uh the line hold the line do, 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 do. love isn't always on time oh whoa whoa okay let's see anything else just retweets of the same tweets that i'm seeing Oh, yeah, there it is. Evander Kane is four times 5.1. St. Louis Blues are working for a four-year deal to keep Nick Letty. Working on the AAV. So Nick Letty staying a St. Louis Blue. Drew to Ottawa. Yes, it's on the it's on the little uh, scrolly thing in my jigger. It's coming. It's coming. Goudreau was the first one I put in the lineup. So whenever you guys see Goudreau, that's the first one I put in the lineup. So that's when it repeats. Drew to Ottawa. So it's coming. It's coming. It's. C Didn't really want Letty back here. Not that I didn't want Letty back here, honestly. Uh, sorry to my friend Danielle, because she loves him. But I didn't want Letty back on the Islanders. Uh, so the fact that they're getting him back in St. Louis, good for them. Honestly. Uh, we have a puck-moving younger defenseman now. in um, And there's the Giroux. Uh, in Romanov, which I'm really happy about. Yeah, that's another thing, too. Let's say the Islanders were to get Johnny Goudreau. Would Barzell give up number 13? How would that work? Who would get to keep number 13? Would it be Barzell? Or would it be Goudreau? Do you think Goudreau would change numbers? Or do you think Barzell would change his number? Because also, if he goes to New Jersey, he sure. He sure's number 13. So, you have two problems there. Like, I feel like either way, Goudreau was going to have to change his number. So, it's it's not like that's deterring him from coming to the Islanders either. Because he's going to have to change his number either way. Columbus signed uh, defenseman David uh, Jerichek. Sixth overall... Matichuk to three year entry level contracts, blah. <laughs> Blue Jays fired their manager. Uh, Michael, I don't know. I think Philadelphia is not as far in the running as I think they are. I think. Especially now that they're unwilling to part with their first round pick. In that cat situation. 
I don't know if the Flyers are as high in the standings as many believe them to be. I really don't think they are. I think this really can come down to Islanders or Devils, in my opinion. I really do think this can be Islanders or Devils here. A devil signing 1.3 mil? Uh, nothing's come up on my feed. That's the thing, Haley, is that will he go to his hometown because he has the opportunity to? That's com- I mean, we've seen it before! We- hmm, what other Johnny Hockey has wanted to go home? Hmm. <laughs> like, yeah, I, we've seen it before, like- at least he told his team he didn't want to stay. Just saying. <clears throat> yeah. And we're not waiting on free agency day hoping he'll sign back. He did sign one. Oh, he did sign with the Blues. I haven't seen anything about, um, his blue signing. Oh, cool, cool, cool. Let's go, Chrysler! Chrysler, Chrysler. Oh, I'm so happy for Thomas. So, one year, 1.3. Oh, I'm so happy for Thomas. Let's go. Oh, I forgot to put St. Louis in there. Hold on, let me fix it. <laughs> Uh, St. Louis. Okay. Michael, we don't have to trade anything for Goudreau. He's a UFA. Why Why did they set free agency day on day two of Prime Day? Is, I don't know, man. James King, I wish I knew too. I have no idea. I don't care, NHL.com. You're so behind. <laughs> Josh Hosang's in the KHL. I don't care. <laughs> Thomas Boyle says it's on cat friendly. I'm going to text Brittany Grice. Oh, some signing just happened. Hold up. Elaine Freeman. Vancouver signs Curtis Lazar for three years. One million AAV. So, Lazar. Vancouver. Basically, three years. One million AAV. Not bad. Quiet morning for Dylan Strom's camp, but things are starting to pick up on the 25-year-old. So, Dylan Strom has been quiet this morning. But apparently, now the calls are coming in. Okay. I hope so, 79 Isles. I hope there's something up loose sleeves. I'm waiting. That's a good signing by the Knox. And honestly is. Curtis Lazar for only 1 million AAV? Honestly, not bad. Three years, 1 million? I take it. So I'll put Curtis Lazar to the Knox. To Vancouver. Three times, three times one AAV. Clay will be happy with that. Absolutely. Why, why would you be upset with that? It's one million. I'm 
I love people. I love people who are just like, I don't care. Oh, Calgary signs Kevin Rooney. Two times 1.2. Kevin Rooney to Calgary. But I guess that's the Goudreau placement? Replacement? Um, but yeah. So the New York Ranger going to Calgary. They took Rooney. Yes, Kevin Rooney. The New York Ranger going to Calgary. Two times 1.2. Rip Rooney. <laughs> So rip Kevin Rooney, the ex Ranger. Two times, two times one point two. All right, that's on the board. Okay, so our full free, the only UFAs we have are Chara, Zarnik, Green, Hickey, Ledoux, and Schneider. So really, who's gonna, who's gonna really going to want a lot of them? I don't think anyone's going be, to gonna be calling up Chara's camp and being like, yo, you want to play? Like, <laughs> Plus, Chara's not going to be making a decision until September if he still wants to play. No, Kevin Rooney was very cheap. And I think they still have plenty of space to go with Calgary. Like, they're not done. Calgary's not done. Especially since they didn't sign, uh, uh, Goudreau. <laughs> Drew is now on TSN. He's talking on TSN. Bro. Chara is not officially retired. Nothing done yet with the Capitals and Kemper. Certainly trending that way, but as of this minute, nothing is done between Kemper and the Capitals. But Chara has said he has not made any decisions until... He will not make any final decisions until September. What, Sam? Sam, how are you feeling about possibly getting Brent Burns? A trade possibly happening in that direction? Thomas, it's it's already on the, the thingamajigger. Maybe I should make this go a little bit faster. Because, uh... I should probably make it go a little faster. Where's my... There we go. Make it go a tiny bit faster. Oh, that's a little too fast. Hold on. Let's try that. There we go. That's a little bit faster. It's already on the thing. I got it up. Do you think Green retires? That's another question mark. That's another question mark, Joseph. I don't know. I'm fired up. I'm gonna leave now. Sam! <laughs> Sam, I'm sorry! But Kemper's still a, a question. Oh, uh, Rooney is 1.3, not 1.2 AAV. Thanks a lot. Thanks a lot, Elliot. It's 1.3 AAV, not 1.2. So let me fix. So that's fixed. <laughs> Sam. <laughs> I feel like you're faster than the NHL free agency day. Props to you. <laughs> hey, the layer slayer. I got you. That's why I'm here, bro. That's why I got I got the noties. I got I got <laughs> I got it all up here, man. I I got you guys. I'm here for you. Because I know I'm a fan. We want it as fast as possible. I feels. Took an email. Just double check the NHL. Roman on the name did not come. Woo! Whoa. Oh, guys. Islanders news. Islanders news for my Islanders fans in here. Uh, full FA list. We So, Andrew Gross just post posted the full free agency list. For RFAs. For the R RFAs, Romanov's name didn't come up. 
And Andrew Gross goes, a few of you pointed out Romanov's not on the list. And he goes, in the email I received, no? Oh, oh, Trocek has signed in the, the for the New York Rangers. New York Rangers and Trocek have agreed to seven-year deal. Seven-year deal with the Rangers and Vincent Trocek. Seven-year deal. AAV to come. AAV to come. Holy shit. People saying... People saying L. Oh no. People are saying this is a big L. Oh my god, seven years for Vincent Trojak. Yes, he is old. Seven years. Woo! That's a long term. But yes, details for coming from Frank Cervalli. Oh, what is this? Robert Thomas has signed an eight-year extension with St. Louis Blues. Eight times 8.1. Robert Thomas. Holy moly. Robert Thomas signed an eight, eight times 8.1 extension with the St. Louis Blues. Holy moly. Just turned 29. Uh, the AAV hasn't come out on Trocheck yet. So, Robert Thomas stays in St. Louis. Trocheck news still hasn't been finalized. People are like, how many years? People are like, what the F? <laughs> okay, someone brought up a good point about Romanov. They're saying because he is a 10.2 RFA. So what that means is when you are a 10.2 RFA, no one can offer sheet you. So no other team can offer sheet... Uh, you or get arbitration rights, things like that. Um, so, like, with uh, Romanov, he can't be offer sheeted. Unless you own the rights to Romanov, no one else can sign you. Things like that. So, that's probably why he's not on the RFA list. Uh, don't know the uh, minute details about it, but that's a possibility why he's not on our RFA list. Don't know. But it could be a possibility why he's not on our RFA list. God. Oh, Nicholas okay, Obey Kubel goes to, to Toronto. He goes to the Toronto Maple Leafs. Nicholas Obey Kubel from the Avalanche goes to the Toronto Maple Leafs for 1.1. One, 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 one year, one mil. What? What? Obey Kubel, a Toronto Maple Leaf for one one year, one mil. That's it. Oh my god. He's gonna drop the cup with us. Oh, that's it? Oh my god. That's it? Bro. That's a steal in my opinion. Oh 
What the actual hell? Are you kidding? That is a steal. Yeah, when you when you bash the cup and yo he you know what he bashed the cup and now he's gonna bring all that bad cup luck all the way to Toronto. <laughs> <laughs> he had to bash up the cup in seven different places and now bring all that bad cu cup luck to Toronto. <laughs> he has to. You, all, is, Nichols Albie Cabell has to go to Toronto and tell the tell Austin Matthews and John Tavares what a cup feels like. <laughs> I'm sorry, I'm sorry. Okay, I'll stop. <laughs> oh, but that's an amazing signing. <coughs> <coughs> sorry, guys. Sorry guys, I told you about the coughing fits I have today. I'm still fighting that chest cold. Um, I took a COVID test. I don't have COVID, so we Gucci. Did they show the AAV yet? Trocheck is seven years at 5.6 million AAV. Five point six. So Trocheck, seven years, five point six to five. So five point six. Whoa. Where's Trocheck? There he is. I gotta write New York Rangers. Five, seven times 5.6. There it is. Goudreau changed his Instagram profile pic to what? <laughs> Thanks, Jeff. As a Flames fan, he's going to New Jersey. Uh, yeah, I know. Seven times 5.6. They signed Trocheck over Cop. They signed Trocheck over cop. Why? Joseph says we don't know yet. Well, it's the closest we have. I can fix it if need be, but that's the closest we have to the AAV for Trocheck, so I'm gonna keep it. Honestly, Jeff, it's a really bad contract. <laughs> uh... <laughs> Hey, Rangers did something horrible. <laughs> yeah, it's done. It's a done deal. <coughs> Sorry, guys. Yeah, Jordan, uh, apparently it's seven years, 5.625. Yeah, feel better, Sam. They told Cop to take a hike for Trocheck for seven, seven years, 5.625. Oh, well, when they love signing guys like Truba at eight million deals, like mm. Cop to the Red Wings. Yep. Cop to the Red Wings. Five years, 5.625. The same amount of money. Two less years for Cop. 
and you signed Trocheck. What? <laughs> what are you doing, Rangers? What are you doing, Rangers? You had Andrew Cop. That's a that's a Heiserman W. What are you doing? Like what? You had it. The same amount of money. And you told cop to beat it and sign Trocheck? You know what? I, I would have taken cop for the two more years. That's a ooh. Maddie C, I don't know if that's true. Maddie C, I heard that rumor, but I don't know if it's true. Oh, man, they messed up. Oh, someone said, mm. <laughs> yeah, like someone said, oh, like, look, Johnny Goudreau has in his profile New Jersey Calgary. Yes, because he's from New Jersey and he played for Calgary. That doesn't mean crap. He's from New Jersey and he played for Calgary. Like, that doesn't mean he's going to New Jersey. He still has Calgary in his thing. If he didn't, if he was playing for New Jersey, he wouldn't have Calgary there. You know what I mean? Like, that doesn't mean anything. He's always had that. Yeah, but, uh, that's exactly. People are sending me this and I'm like, it doesn't mean anything. Calm yourself. Calm. <coughs> Chest cold suck. Chest colds absolutely suck. But you want to know why I haven't been doing videos about the draft or anything? <clears throat> this is why. <clears throat> because I literally could not talk for more than five minutes without coughing. And I didn't feel like editing every two minutes of my videos of me coughing. Editing me coughing out, so... <clears throat> He also ha even had Philly- Yo, he was at a Philly training camp! Like, you all gotta chill. Whatever happens, happens! We're not GMs, we're fans, we sit here, we wait. Whatever happens, happens. <laughs> like... <laughs> Jordan, though, if- I, With your team, the chance to have either Trocheck or Cop for how they were playing for you I would've taken Cop. That was a missed opportunity in my book. Oh, Trocheck live on air. Guess they had they had something against him. They had something against Cop, man. I guess they just they were not. Holes would help. A little bit. <laughs> <clears throat> I need an expectorant. Because here's the thing. It's like, <laughs> Holes is like, like to suppress cough. I need like an expectorant. Who's even coaching the Isles? <clears throat> Lane Lambert. <clears throat> Lane Lambert is our head coach. Goudreau put New Jersey in his Insta bio. Soul, it's, that was always there. He's from New Jersey. <laughs> oh my god, everyone's noticing that now. It's always been there. <laughs> His Insta bio means nada. His Insta bio means nada. And let me tell you now, he's not going to be changing his Insta bio before any contract goes through. <clears throat> and Amadeus, I'm not saying no, that he won't be signing in New Jersey. I'm saying it's a big opportunity and I think a big chance he'll be signing in New Jersey. I nev I've never said no. Do I think there's a chance maybe he could go to the Islanders? Do I think there's a 0.1% chance? Yes. And am I holding on to that 0.1% chance? Yes. Because that's what makes free agency day fun to have my heart broken <laughs> <clears throat> uh, 
Oh my goodness. Ow, 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 ow. Ow, ow, ow. You think it's that low, Joseph? I'm, I'm just making up numbers. <laughs> I'm just making up numbers. I'm just kind of ha having fun with it. Do you think the Islanders would be better off something else who isn't Goudreau? His contract won't age well. You know, that's the that's the hard part. Um, We could possibly do two contracts that would possibly equal up to Goudreau. It's just we <coughs> we need that big score. We do. We need that big score and someone, we just need that, that, that piece. And I really think it could be someone like a Goudreau. Ole Mata possibly to Detroit. Damn. Iserman is just going. Whew. What is this? The Blackhawks have signed forward Athanasio and Max Domi, according to a source. The Blackhawks with Athanasio and Domi? What? Someone said not Domi. <laughs> Bro, yeah, why Domi? Athena see you. Not a bad take. Domi. Islanders should stay away from Kadri. As much as I like Kadri, I don't think he's the goal scorer we need. Kadri, I think I think he's pretty I think he's a pretty great player. I just don't think he's that piece we need. Yep, there's Nick Letty. He's four, he, he got a four times four. And, ooh, y'all, St. Louis fans are pissed. Nick Letty with a four times four in St. Louis. They're saying Ilya Lab Labushkin headed to Buffalo. So, yo, Lee fans, Labushkin, going to the Buffalo Sabres. Huh. Picking up a nice D-man. Addy, no! <laughs> yeah! There you go. Ilya Labushkin going to Buffalo. Womp womp. Hearing Arizona Coyotes are on the verge of signing veteran forward Nick Bukestad and experienced defenseman Josh Brown and Troy Stetcher. So Arizona now moving in on Bukestad. Oh my goodness. <laughs> Addy says, I am so sad. <laughs> yeah, that was uh, done by Bob McKenzie. <coughs> I hate being sick. Being sick sucks. <laughs> but yeah, so Toronto fans taking the L there. I love saying his name, Nabushkin. <laughs> <laughs> Leafs keep taking L's. The only W you've had today is Abe Kubel. <clears throat> I have his signature on that stick over there too. And now he's a Leaf. No! <laughs> I met Nicholas Abe Kubel too. He was so nice too. Uh, and horrible for Turn. <clears throat> Oh, uh, just Jordan. That was just, yeah. Oof. The Red Wings, here's the thing. The Red Wings, the weird thing about them is that they'll look so good on paper and then they'll play like, they'll play horribly. That's the only thing about the Red Wings is like, <clears throat> Iserman will put this team together and they're like, wow, that team's going to like kill. And then you see them play and they're like, wow, they're crap. <laughs> Oh, 
Oh man, they they're showing the top six for the senators. Whew. <clears throat> One year, three million AA AAV for each of Athens, U, and Domi in Chicago. Do you guys want me to add that to the bottom? Apparently, Lab uh, Labushkin's going to Buffalo, apparently. Yeah, Yoshi, it was, it was tweeted by Bob McKenzie. Bob McKenzie tweeted it. <clears throat> Do you guys want me to add Domi and Athena CU down here? Michael T, we'd have to trade for him. Also, Cop is one year younger than Trochak. Predicting Mikheyev is going to Arizona or Anaheim. Labushkin headed to Buffalo. Two years, 2.75. Two, two years, 2.75 for Labushkin and Buffalo. Do you guys want me to add all of these? I will add all of these. <clears throat> so. Two times two points. Seven five. I'm gonna write two point seven five for him because I can't round that one. Usually I just round up or down. Okay, and then uh, Athanasiu. I'm gonna do Athanasiu and Domi together. Chicago. One times, and they got one times three. Okay. Okay, they're added. The letting side, you see, yeah, Joseph, some people are happy with it. Some people absolutely hate it. And that's how it is. I mean. Honestly, I was not the biggest fan of Nicoletti when he was on the Islanders. So I don't know. I don't know why Chicago signed Domi. Coyote signed Josh Brown to two-year contract. Uh, Coyote's also signed Troy Stretch, uh, Stetcher to a one-year deal. Red Wings to Olimata for one, one for one. One, 2.25. Olimata, one year, 2.25. I know, <laughs> the Layer Slayer. We're waiting. We're waiting. Islanders fans literally, we have, we, we don't know crap. We literally don't know crap. And I just realized I didn't put AAV next to Trocheck. I'm going to make it go a little faster. Okay. Halak to New York Rangers. It's Halak. Is Halak a free agent? Yeah, because... I haven't seen anything about Halak. Ma to Edmonton? I haven't seen anything about that. 
Domi had one good game for us. Good game seven for us and then dipped. Uh, Michael T, hell no. Oh my god, give me updates. Give me updates. Give me updates. Rangers got troll check. Yes, you did, David. Although, in my opinion, e. Yeah, I was about to say, David, do you really like that contract? Yeah, apparently Mott has moved on. Let me see if I see anything about Mott. Uh, latest on Mott. Nothing about Mott signing. I don't know where you get about Mott signing. Nothing about Mott. Mott's still a free agent. Sounds like Eric Comrie to Buffalo. Jordan, chill. Looks like Mott's still f available. This is via El Elliot Friedman. Eric Comrie to Buffalo. He's saying two times 1.8. That's what you think, Jordan. I don't know how movable that is. Buffalo doing a lot of work here. That's, actually, that's honestly such a reasonable deal. Eric Comrie for 2 times 1.8. That's such a reasonable deal. It's true, Jordan. It's true. Kind of bluffed about his trade value, though. <laughs> I don't know, but Comrie, two times one point eight. Not bad. It's not a bad deal. So Buffalo gets Labushkin and Comrie. Yeah, someone posted this. They're like, every minute you don't hear about Goudreau and the Devils is always a good thing. And I'm like, oh, 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 oh. Sharks Hurricanes trade. Brent Burns and Lane Peterson for Steven L Lawrence. Goalie prospect Etu McEniemi and a conditional 2023 third round pick. Sharks are retaining 33% of Burns' contract. The trade is done. Sam, where's Sam? Yes! Brent Burns and Lane Peterson for Steven Lawrence. Goalie prospect Etu McEniemi. And a conditional 2023 third round pick. Sharks are retaining 33% of Burns' contract. Here you go. If you guys read it and weep. Pause that if you have to. Go, you can scroll back. Pause that if you have to. Mikhaev to Vancouver. But Carolina, you have Brent Burns.
Maca Canucks have signed right wing Ilya Mikheyev to four years. What's the AAV? I don't. Yeah, but that's speculation, Jordan. Four years to the Canucks. Oh boy. <laughs> With what money is someone getting traded, someone said? <laughs> Yo, but like seriously, how are they paying this boy? How are they paying Mikhaev? How much are they paying Mikhaev? Sheesh! They won't tell me how much they're paying Mikhaev! You put the AAV in the chat? How did you get that so fast? 4.75. How did you get that so fast? Where did you get that, bro? Yo, how did you find that, though? Insiders, yeah, okay. Ba -ba -ba. Ba -ba -ba. Oh my god, there's so much happening right now. Ah. Yeah, Olimata with the Red Wings. I thought someone said he was going somewhere else. I don't remember. Sorry. Ilya. Mikhaev. I'm trying to update this as fast as possible for you guys. I'm so sorry. Four times 4.75. I should put the team he's going to. That would help. Vancouver. <laughs> there we go. What's up? Halak signed with the New York Rangers. Alexa off. Sorry, I don't know that one. Yeah, me either. <laughs> Yars. Halak, you traitor! One point one point five five. Okay. How lucky trader. Yaro Halak. One time. I mean, that's a very reasonable con con contract. Contract. <laughs> I can't speak anymore, guys. Please help. Send help. By the way, if you see any. Uh, mistakes in the uh, thing below, please tell me. Okay, I'm looking for updates. Sorry guys, I'm not, it's not like I'm not paying attention to you. I'm trying to get updates to you. Uh, Chirot going to Detroit. Very Ben Chirot going to Detroit. Nemesnikov back in Tampa one year, uh, one year contract. So, uh, I don't know who said the Tampa ain't gonna be doing nothing, but Nemesnikov is back. Oh, crazy dog. Just saw your comment. Chirot to Detroit. Yes, Harry Rice. Uh, Van Young. He, apparently he did agree to the trade. Yes, because I know he has the no movement clause, but apparently he did agree to the trade. Apparently because he's been- apparently he's wanted to move. Oh, John, trust me. The fact that you don't hear anything at a lose camp is, like, hurting my heart. It's been an hour!
come on. Oh man, this is brutal. I know, I know you're saying that. We'll see what happens with him, Addy. We'll see. Van Young, where did you see that? Uh, it was uh, approved uh, a little while ago. Uh, Dave Pagnota, I think, tweeted about it. <coughs> yes, Dave Pagnota tweeted about it six minutes ago. The Carolina has officially required, uh, officially acquired. Brent Burns via a trade that they had a whole uh, package. Um, if you back up in the video, uh, th there's a whole deal that went down. Uh, Pierre Lebrun did the whole breakdown of the trade, if you want to go see that. Um, what big uh, players are left besides JG? Uh, Kadri is left. Kadri's a big one. Andre Palat is still available. Klingberg. Um, Cop is now gone. Um, <coughs> Dylan Strom is still available. We have Dylan Strom that's still on the board. Yes, Palat is still available. Not official yet. NHL has not announced that trade. It's been announced via Pierre Lebrun and two inside sources who are very reliable, though. I say it's pretty much going to be 100% done. The NHL app is severely behind. I say it's done deal. I never trust the NHL app because it will take it like 30 minutes to say a deal that's already been announced an hour ago. Like, it will take an hour for it to be like, oh, this is done. Nick Bukestad to the Coyotes on a one-year deal. And they're saying Burakovsky to Seattle. Ooh. They're saying Burakovsky is going to go to Seattle. Do I think Lou's looking to make a trade? I have no clue. The only reason I would see Lou to make a trade is if we don't get Goudreau. The Goudreau sweepstakes are down to the Devils and Islanders. I've said that since the beginning, Harry. I've said that the Flyers have not been in this since the beginning. Sorry, Flyers fans, but I've said it's been down to the De uh, Devils and Islanders. Um, Harry Rice, we've known that since before 12 o'clock. It was just a matter of when they got the contract done. <laughs> Van Young, I'm just saying, like, the NHL.com, it's just very slow. <laughs> but yeah, Bukestad is now a coyote. But you're hearing Kemper 5 times 5.5? This is so. Uh, I'm scared. I'm scared. Yeah. TSN confirms that Goudreau sweepstakes are down to Devils and Islanders. Kinda made a mood by something. <laughs> Holy crap. I can't. 
The fact that it just says our name there. The fact that it just says our name there. I'm gonna like puke. I'm g- and you know what? This this is not helping. This is not helping. <laughs> Sam, Tarasenko is not a UFA. He is still under contract. He would have to be traded for. That's why he's, like, not technically going anywhere. If, like, the Islanders were to go for him, we would have to trade for him, like a Brent Burns situation. Uh, yes, Haley, Sam. Frank v Vetrano! Oh! Rangers, you're losing another player! Frank Vetrano going to Anaheim Ducks! Three times 3.65! Vetrano saying bye bye to the New York Rangers after this past year, and he is going to the Anaheim Ducks. Yeah, Harry Rice, I literally just said it. <laughs> Yes, uh, Van Young, I reported that before. I just didn't, I don't have it down here because it's, it's like myth. Frank Vetrano? I'm going to put Frank, Frank Vetrano up. He's going to Anaheim. And he's going for three times 3.65. All right, he's up. Posted eight minutes ago. I, I post- uh, I said it before. I told you NHL F is slow, bro. <laughs> oh, Toronto Maple Leaf signing. Adam Gaudet. One year contract for the Maple Leafs. The Maple Leafs have signed Adam Gaudet. I'm not sure about AAV. 750k. Nice, easy signing. 750k for Gaudet. Oh, there's Crazy Dog doing it with me. My stream keeps delaying. Well, that's your problem here. <laughs> oh. But 750k for Adam Gaudet? Not bad. Michael T. Uh, no, we couldn't afford that. Michael T., we would never be able to afford that. Yeah, Jordan literally goes with cat. Like, we, we can't afford that. <laughs> honestly, I'm gonna need to get. Honestly, like, they're, they're gonna. You're gonna guys gonna see my parents call 911 and they're gonna go, like, clear. Like, <laughs> like oh. they have the breakdown of the Giroux contract. So for his first year, it's seven, second year, seven, and the third year is 5.5. Oh my god. I keep refreshing, bro. Oh, my stomach is in knots. Is anyone else's stomach in and you Oh my god. I can't, I can't breathe. Sam, you want to trade for Tarasenko? Or do you want to wait the year to possibly get him in like a free agency? Dobson's not going anywhere. Yeah, no, Dobson's not going anywhere. Lou has said that they are they're signing Dobson. Like, no. <laughs> Seattle might be picking up Andre Burakovsky. I saw that already, Harry. Uh, Radulov is no longer with the Dallas Stars. Hmm. I think I saw that actually. Someone help. I'm like freaking out right now. Help, 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 help. Oh my god, I'm freaking out. Help, 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 help. Mm. 
a lot of rumblings about Klingberg, and the Dallas Stars have re-engaged. Not confirmed, not done, but makes sense that Dallas missing out on Burns. Let's see where this goes. So apparently Dallas and Klingberg have reignited talks. So just some uh, talks there about Dallas Stars and Klingberg. I thought we would have already had Goudreau nurse. I'm not even going to lie. I thought we would have already had Goudreau nurse. This is nuts. I wasn't sure about heading to Russia. Okay. The only one I knew heading to Russia was a... Uh... What's his face? Oh, sorry. Yeah, I know, Mikey. Claudette, yep, with a 750k. It's uh down here. I think it's right after Vetrano here. Yep. Um, actually, I didn't put Claudette. Yeah, because that's the end there. Goudreau's the first. Yep, Harry Rice, I literally just said it. <laughs> oh my god. Yep, Vetrano signed in Anaheim, Jordan. He's an Anaheim Duck now. Adam Gaudet was with the Senators. Kulak re-signs in Edmonton. Kulak has re-signed in Edmonton. Comrie to Buffalo, yes. Just letting you know, Jordan. X now another X Ranger gong. I want Mott. He's still on the board. Canucks now over the cap and have RFA Travis Dermott to sign. Whew, yeah. Well, because they just signed Mikheyev. They have to clear cap space. Not quite. Looks like Mason Marchment to Carolina on a four year deal. Where's Sam? Mason Marchman to Carolina. Kulak is a four year 2.75 in Edmonton. Looks like Mason Marchman going to Carolina on a four year deal, sir. Kulak going to Edmonton on a four times 2.75. Excuse me. Excuse moi. But yeah, four years of Kulak. Nothing about uh, AAV with uh, Marchment. But it's saying if it gets finalized. So it's an if. So it's up in the air right now. Lou is trending. Islanders are trending. I see Islanders trending. Sergachev signs an eight year extension with Tampa Bay. Sergachev, eight-year extension with Tampa Bay. Ooh. Wow. That is a oh, maximum extension. He is going to end his career a Tampa Bay Lightning player. Holy crap. Eight years? Holy moly. Wow. 
Wow. Yeah, I know. Holby is most likely going to retire. Which is, it's honestly a shame. He's, you know, so can, I, I, I know he's kind of dropped off, but Holby is still an incredible goaltender in my, my mind. No AAV posted yet. I am enjoying today, says Sam. But, I really feel bad. 8.5! 8, 8 times 8.5! Holy moly. 8 times 8.5. Oh my god. They also have to sign Sorelli and Cernak, don't they? 8.5 8.5 million That's the AAV guys Let me put it in Oof Putting it in. That is nuts. That is nuts. Richard, it's on there. That is actually crazy. I'm gonna make it go a little faster. Hopefully it's not too fast. No, I think that's a little better, honestly. Rocha, what's the big simping? What's up? Brent Burns and his, actually you retained 33% of it. So you still, you still have a bit of his contract, Rocha. But yes, most of it is gone. Big simping. You did retain a bit of it, but yeah. Big simping, what's up? By the way, I changed Rogelio's um, command. If, uh, if mods, if you go into the um, description and you look up mod commands, Rogelio's is now just Rogelio. Well, still, most of it is gone. Yes. I cannot believe they- I cannot believe they extended Sergachev that much- that much time and that much money. That is gonna bite them in the ass. In my personal opinion. I really think that's gonna bite them in the ass. Holy crap. Do I think Sergachev's an amazing player? Yes, don't get me wrong. But to- and they got to sign Sorelli and Cernak. Sorelli and Cernak are looking at that contract going, damn. <gasps> Oilers finally got a real goalie. <laughs> they got Jake Campbell, Jack Campbell. And uh, if you talk to Toronto fans, uh, he's eh. It's like, it's meh. You know, he's not, he's not a horrible goaltender. Is he the greatest goaltender? Well, uh, he's he's got his flaws. No problem, Jordan. I know you're at work. The thing is, we have we're waiting for the Johnny Goudreau news. The Johnny Goudreau news. It's down between the Islanders and the Devils. It's 
between the Islanders and Devils. Um, but from something I read, my friend Stefan, he's, uh, he does media for the Islanders. He said that with talking to somebody who knows Johnny Goudreau very well, if you're looking at the Islanders and Devils, the Islanders are on a win now, are a win now team. We're in that stage where we, we need to rush and go now. The Devils are on a team that are trying to build and Johnny Goudreau is at a stage in his career where he wants to win now. You know, he's 29 years old. He wants to win. And from what someone who knows him personally and a, a source that he knows, um, Johnny Goudreau takes winning very seriously. Very, very seriously. And... So that might be a big driving force in his decision. But of course, then there's home. There's, you know, being close to family, being in his home environment, being where he grew up. And that's always a big factor. And, do you, you know, do you take that risk? Of course, my friend from Vegas, being nice. I have my friends from... I have some really good friends from Vegas that I met uh, through the Leonard fandom. Cheering, cheering me on, going, I hope hope there's good news and stuff like that. <coughs> and then there's the question. Should the Islanders go after a guy like Sonny Milano? Is this his home? <laughs> Eight times six point two. What is with the term? What is with the damn term for Tampa? Sorelli eight times six two five. What the? What is with the term? <laughs> where are they? Number one, where are they getting this money? Where's with the money? And they are just throwing term. Like stay here forever. We wanna we wanna ride the the two the two year cups the two cup years forever. Like they just wanna ride the two year cups years forever. Yeah, no, no Joseph. That's why I said number one. Where the fuck are they getting this money? Where in the hell are they getting this money? Where is Tampa getting this money out of their asses? And you get an eight year. You you all get an eight year. Where are they getting this money? What? Do the Oprah meme. Where's Oprah? <laughs> like, what? Tokarski is to Pittsburgh. Uh, never close the door. Confirming Klingberg and the Dow Stars are talking extension. Yep, we talked about that. But holy crap! Let's talk. Let's put in Sorelli. What is going on? Where are they getting all this money? Like, I don't understand. Where are the Tampa Bay Lightning getting all this money? I don't understand. How much was it? 6.25? 6.25. After they just paid. 8.5. I don't... And what are they going to play Cernic? Eight years, seven million? Like, are they going to go in between? <sighs> like, 
Like, honestly, the le- I'm, I'm just going to say this out loud, though. The less we hear about Goudreau, the better for the Islanders. Because you know how Lou works. You guys know how Lou works. The less we hear about Johnny Goudreau negotiations, the that better it means for the Islanders. So while we're, even though we're sitting here in pain, that's better news for us. <laughs> Devils and Islanders in a battle for Goudreau. Might be down to them unless someone jumps back in last minute. Shut up, Pagnota! Shut up! (laughs) Right as I said that! Right as I said that, he tweets that! Shut up! (laughs) Cernak is eight, eight times five. Where are they getting this money? I really thought they would go in between. (laughs) <laughs> where do you see the Cernak contract oh there it is 5.2 I really thought they would go in between <laughs> they, re- <laughs> they really did 8 years for everyone where are they getting this money bro where is this money coming from bro why is everyone getting 8 years next season like what is going on what is going on (laughs) honestly what is what what side shit are they doing to get this money eight year contracts for all three of them are you kidding Like, I don't, I don't understand. I know, James. I feel like, like, the moment you get up, something's gonna happen. You're gonna get up to go get something and it's gonna be like... (laughs) I just saw a tweet that said Pat Maroon's gonna get an eight-year deal with with Arby's. (laughs) <laughs> oh man, but what even? Eight-year extensions for three players. I'm like, I'm sorry, I'm still staring dumbfounded at my phone. Eight-year extensions for three players. 8.5. Six point something. And 5.2. What even? Oh, God, this looks so wrong. No, what is this? No, what is this? Oh, God, what is this? What am I looking at? Oh, no, no, this looks... Oh, God, this looks so... No, he doesn't look good in red. Where's the blue? No, that's not Brent... That's not Brent Burns. No, 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 no. Oh, God, this looks so wrong. Oh, God, it... It looks so wrong. <laughs> Get rid of the black room. <laughs> no, it's so wrong. It 
<laughs> Yo, where's Jordan? <laughs> okay, that got me. <laughs> Yo! Thanks so much! Thanks for subbing. Welcome to the fam! How are you guys liking the new sub gift, by the way? Thank you so much for subbing. Yo, thank you so much, man. I appreciate that. But yeah, thank Mike Jones. Uh, that's the new sub gift, guys. Uh, so I added new sub gifts. I added new dono gifts. So, what's that donos? It's, um... Super chats. So I added new super chat gifts. I added new sub gifts. So I hope you like that one. That's Sam doesn't probably doesn't like that. <laughs> Sam, do you remember that that gift? <laughs> I want to see if Sam re remembers that. What? Rick DiPietro said on the point that if the Islanders get Goudreau, he will streak around the studio. Um, I have a new, uh, sub, uh, gif. So, when I get a new sub, you'll see it. Um, and yeah, it's a gif of a certain moment, uh, that you probably won't like. If you back up, if you back up in the stream, you, you, you'll you be able to see it. <laughs> uh, by the way, Addy in the group chat, yes, uh, they're retaining 33%. Joseph, if it's not done today, I'm... Mm. <laughs> Brendan Lemieux is going to LA, 1 times 3.5. Brendan Lemieux to LA. He goes, you. <laughs> hey, Sam saw it. <laughs> Sorry, bro. I had to do it. It's such a far. I love their celly there. And I'm celebrating the new person coming in. So. One times 3.5. Oh my god. The landscapers. <laughs> Hope you don't hear my landscaper. Apparently it's very competitive. That's how I'd like to hear it. I, you know what? I appreciate that Lou's going all in. Yeah, true. <laughs> Okay, let's see. Oilers continue to work on Connor Brown. My friend says the Islanders should go after Andre Pilat. I'm not against it. If we can't get a Johnny Goudreau, I'd be all for an Andre Pilat. What do you guys think? It's another great winger. I, I'd be down for a plot. I think that'd be interesting. Oh my god, Elliot Friedman! He's screwing up the AAVs! Sam says you brought this on yourself? Is that Bryce Harper? <laughs> Who is that? <laughs> one- Oh, okay, it's not- Okay, so if the, it's one times 1 1.35, not 3.5. Come on, Elliot. Who is that, Sam? I can't really see it. <laughs> Uh, 
It's the pic from us sweeping you in 2019. Oh, okay. Yeah, I can barely see that. <laughs> Honestly, we knew we were gonna- We knew we were gonna get swept by you kinda in 2019, so we weren't really that upset. I just looked up Kane's Isles 2019. <laughs> no news, 79. No news. Oh, there we go. Yeah, Haley, thanks so much for subbing. Look at that beautiful gif. Yeah. Woo. <laughs> Got the Palmieri Selly. We're all hugging and celebrating. Haley joining the squad. Thank you, Haley. Uh, <laughs> Kim, go to John and demand he signs with the Islanders. <laughs> I can't do anything to make Goudreau come. Well, you hurt me feelings. <laughs> I'm sorry, but I, I honestly just love that celebration by Paul Mary. That is such a... Hi, Haley. But I love that celebration by Paul Mary. It is such a fun celebration. <laughs> I know it. It had to be against your boys, but it's like it, against any other team. Like, I would I would have loved it. <laughs> I need to knock on his door. <laughs> I'm, I knock on his door and I'm just like Patrick and I'm just like, I love you. <laughs> <laughs> Sam, I'm sorry, bro. <laughs> oh, I have it, Annie. I would show it to you if I wouldn't be copyrighted. <laughs> if I wouldn't be copyrighted, I would so show it to you, Annie, because I have it on here. But I would be copyrighted. <laughs> Why couldn't it be against, I don't know, New York Rangers? It had to be us. <laughs> Sally cookie crumbled. <laughs> I would love for it to have been against the New York Rangers. Oh my god, Islanders fans are so pessimistic. Aw, Brittany said hi, Letty and, and St. Louis Blues. Bro, well, that, that just breaks my heart. She went, hi, Letty in St. Louis. Not like that, that just breaks my heart, bro. <laughs> Two of my Islanders buds. I'm getting no other news right now via free agency. Charles... I'm gonna screw up his name so bad. Hudden? I'm gonna say Hudden. To Colorado, one year, two way contract. Same players, eight more years. Yeah! <laughs> eight more contracts. Ah! <laughs> like, imagine they just sign more. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> the fact that they have not signed Goudreau is like killing my soul. My brother's such a. My brother's. My brother goes hearing Johnny Goudreau spotted at Smith Haven Mall at Hot Topic. <laughs> okay, nothing's happening on board. Yeah, me too. Signings, signings, signings. <laughs> uh, Joseph, don't get me started. Here's the thing it's not. It's definitely not Tavares' like situation at all. Nothing's Tavares' situation. Here's the thing, Grudro told Calgary he's not coming back. Panarin, I mean, we were like kind in the talks and we did offer, but he said no. It happens, and that can honestly happen here. Shush. <laughs> I don't know if you can hear that. You probably can. I can see my microphone going up. D 
Dude, why, why are you stopped? There we go. Come on. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Thank you. All my cats here. You know, the one who didn't cheer me up after the ball miracle. <laughs> Sorry. This one will be the same. Got them landscaper. Yeah. They're the ones, though. They're so... They, these guys are so fantastic, though. Because they're the ones who help us save the bunnies. Like, they're so caring. Uh, because we had two bunnies' nests on our on our lawn and they found them while cutting uh so we we got a box and we took the bunny the babies into a box and they were they were old enough that they had um going to take a nap see us hopefully some good news van young soon but uh we took them to where they 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 had fur and everything their eyes were open so we took them into the box and we took them out of the way so this way they could cut and they wouldn't hurt the bunnies. So they helped us save, we had one in the back and then we had one in the front. And they helped us save like six bunnies, six baby bunnies uh, from being chopped up. Um, so honestly, they're really great people. And so, and we, my mom and I, we usually um, give them water and things like that. No. Islanders fans, bad news. The fourth period just offered on NHL Network that the Johnny Goudreau sweepstakes is leaning in New Jersey's direction unless the Islanders can step it up a bit. Well. It was nice while it lasted. Um, David Pagnota on NHL Network said that the Goudreau sweepstakes have leaned in New Jersey's favor unless the Islanders can step it up. We Here's the thing, we can't top the offer. We don't have any money. We can't top the offer. We don't have any money. Get rid of Josh Bailey. Oh my god. It's about the money. Oh, just... Oh my god, people putting the Grice as a neo-Nazi.
Oh my god. Oh. Okay. Kemford did sign? Yes, he did sign. Kemper did sign. All right, let's get Kemper done. So he's finally in Washington. We were waiting for this. 5, 2.25. 5.25. So he's going to be there for quite a while. contract with the caps okay so they broke down the Kemper contract year one is six mil year two is six mil year three is six year four is 4.5 and year five is 3.75 so the first three years are all gonna be six and the last two are gonna break down for the less hey Jordan yeah not the signing we want to hear but Red Wings. Goudreau and Kadri unlikely to sign today. Where did you hear that? We have Long Island. They have Newark. Well, he grew up on, in that place they call Newark, so. Yeah, no, Andre Pilat. I don't think he's resigning with Tampa. Especially with those deals. Jesus. How are they going to afford him? Hold on. they even afford Andre Pilat? It looks like the Rangers are keeping Nemeth by flipping him to Arizona. There's no more bunnies, Jordan. We're good. Oh my god. Sam. 
hearing Oilers are bringing back uh, a board singing, bringing a board, excuse me. Uh, oh my god. I can't speak. Uh, Cal Picard as third goaltender behind Jack Campbell and Stuart Skinner. We'll see a number for third goaltender options move here in the next while. Oh my god. This is so tough. This is so tough. I'm just so we're we're gonna hear nothing today. We're going to hear nothing today, and I'm going to have to sit in absolute anguish for another 24 hours, aren't I? Oh, it's going to happen at, like, 3 a.m. <laughs> it's going to happen at, like, 3 a.m. while I'm sleeping, and I'm going to wake up and, like, want to die. That's what's going to happen. It's like, as soon as I end streaming, it's going to be like, Johnny Goudreau signs. It's gonna What is, uh, what is confirmed? That he's not gonna sign today? It's not confirmed, but it's, like, leaning towards that way. Cadre to New York Islanders. No. It's nothing against Kadri, but it's not what we need. Let's say you had a missing, you're missing a piece of the puzzle and it's an oval. And you need to fill that oval hole, right? So you have a piece that's an oval and you have a piece that's a circle. The oval is Johnny Goudreau. The circle is Kadri. So you put that circle piece, does it sort of fit into the, into the oval slot? Sure. But does it completely fill the oval? No. You understand the metaphor? You understand where I'm going for there? No, Jordan. Nick, we wouldn't be in consideration if no one wanted to play for us. Like, if you're just gonna be a dick Rangers fan, you can go. But, like, the thing is, it's just, you know, it's it sucks always being in that situation where it's like, oh, well, they want to go and play at home. Joseph. I actually like Clutterbuck a lot. But, like, th that's what I'm talking about. It's, like, filling that missing piece. It's, like, the, the way I'm trying to describe it. It's nothing against Kadri. He's a great piece. He just doesn't fill that slot. Flyers didn't make any moves today. They're 
also not willing to move that first. They're getting a prospect back for Nemeth. It's not bad. It's really, that's really good. Especially since Nemeth's been horrible. Yeah, no, Flyers have done nothing. Islanders have done nothing. <sighs> this is just pain. Absolute and utter pain. Honestly, like, this is pain. Of course the Islanders are, you know, trying to do as much as they can. fighting at least like the best I can say that is that we're fighting we are fighting as hard as we can <laughs> Jordan's dying that we actually got something that they got something for Nemeth hey go for you man I'm good for you man I'm honestly really happy that you got I'm just dying inside. Yeah, I'm gonna get this set up for you guys. Maybe try to do this. Any Klingberg news? The latest I saw was that he was talking about re-signing with Dallas, but other than that, no. Okay, let's see. Hopefully you guys can still see everything. Here, Sens make Giroud deal official. We'll throw out to add a player, things like that. This is what I've been like, kind of watching. This is all my updates. Uh, all my noties. So you guys can kind of see what I've been looking at. To keep in touch. Easily movable. But yeah, nothing about Klingbergs for a while here. The Kemper breakdown... the signing of Kemper. That's a little Mew signing. The Cirque. This freaking. Oh my god, these signings. Like, what are these? What even armies? Armies are these? This is all, when all that went down, but I haven't seen anything about Klingberg. Yeah, this is the Sunny Milano. Sergachev. But yeah, no, I haven't seen much. It's been kind of quiet. Why? Stefan, why? <laughs> why would be now the time to announce an Andy Green contract? Yeah, because that would get everyone hyped ooh dude that would piss everyone off this would just piss everyone off honestly if this if this happened people would be like yo Lou signs another old man let's go like <laughs> we are officially two hours into free agency though 
happy two hours right here. Boop. Whoop. Who's kind of waiting? Why is Demko trending? Demko is trending. Same guys who made Demko what he is now. Interesting. Nine minutes ago, and what's trending on my timeline? JT Miller and Demko. Canucks fans are sociopaths. <laughs> they what they paid Demko? Lol. The power of Demko. As they're showing uh the J Fresh's uh war roster build. And uh, the Preds are trending. Talk. AHL deal. Smith Howden. The Golden Knights are a team to watch. Do they clear a room? Have heard Max Pacioretty's name out there, but that was four hours ago. What's Talk doing? Yeah, uh, I don't know about that, Joseph. <laughs> what is going on? What? What is this? <laughs> what? Okay, I guess this is not about Tuck, the player. <laughs> what? Okay, so you have top players based on points last season Goudreau, Kadri, Bergeron, Burakovsky, and Perron. So big names still out there still. Yeah, not much boiling down. This is the the greatest with news I guess you could say we've been having. It's the best we've been having so far. But it, Kind of get you an idea of what I'm looking at. ESPN Plus has free agent frenzy. Why wouldn't they? <laughs> I mean, now they're the official like people of the NHL. Even though their announcing made me dro nearly drove me insane. It's so quiet. It is so quiet. I know it's two hours later, but like, it's so quiet. I want to give it like another hour. What do you think? Should I give it like another 30 minutes? Should I give it another hour? Hey, Puddle Soup, we'll see. I don't know what Ross's role, how Ross's role, role will change this season. I don't know what's going to be the change for Ross Johnston coming up. Let me tell you guys, in person, Ross Johnston is like a big teddy bear. <laughs> I don't know if I should be saying that. I don't know if he wants me to say that. But like, Ross Johnston in person is like the nicest person you will ever meet. It's so funny because on the ice, he is, like, such a badass. But in nice, he's, like, the sweetest person you'll ever meet. Like, to me and my friends, he was so freaking nice. So it's done. I said earlier it wasn't done. Hearing that another team has come in late talks with Mason Marchman's camp and Carolina is no longer assured of getting him. So, oh, Carolina no longer assured of getting... Marchment. So, looks like another team has swooped in. So yeah, Klingberg, nothing's official yet. But it lo looks like another team has swooped in on Klingberg. Uh, not on Klingberg, on uh, Mason Marchment. He was talking to only Carolina, but now another team has swooped in. <laughs> Sam goes, bro. <laughs> that was just uh, tweeted by Pierre Lebron. 
Jace, Jordan goes definitely the Rangers. <laughs> you think? That he didn't say what team. Someone said Bruins, someone said Edmonton, someone said Columbus, someone said Buffalo. I feel like I've been Paul married against this Sam. <laughs> Kate says, why did we get another goalie? What the F? <sighs> I'm going to try to move this up. No! I lost Snorlax. Gotta keep Snorlax. God, man. Alright, guys. If I go to use the bathroom, I'll be back in like two minutes. I'll be right back. Hopefully nothing happens. Watch. I go to the bathroom. Something's going to happen. I'm going to go to the bathroom. I'll be gone for like two minutes. Is that cool? <laughs> I swear to God, if something... Oh my God. Wait, what? Oh, sh oh my God. Of course, I'm about to go to the bathroom. And so Capital sign, Lindgren. Three years, 1.1 million. Are you kidding me? Of course stuff happens. <laughs> I have to pee! <laughs> oh my god. Charlie Lindgren to the Capitals. Charlie Lindgren. To Washington. Three years, 1.1. Yeah, it's his brother cousin. So, Charlie Lindgren to... And Mason Marchman goes to Dallas! Dallas is the team that swooped in! And Charlie Lindgren is a goaltender, by the way. But it was Dallas! They swooped in! So... You can be mad at Dallas. Four times 4.5. It, it sounded like he was going to... It sounded like he was going to... Okay, now I gotta go to use the restroom. I'll be right back, guys. I'm sorry. Be right back. I gotta pee.
Okay, we're back. Shut up, Jordan. I saw Goudreau, and you scared me for a moment, and then... Screw you. Oh, you caused me pain. But I've been looking at my phone. Goudreau into the sun. We're not getting him. Oh man, it's 5 nothing Mets though. Holy crap. Alexa, Mets game? The New York Mets are leading the Atlanta Braves 5-0 to zero in the top of the sixth inning. Let's With freaking go! On, Dominic Smith is at the plate for the Mets. The count is 0-0. Zero and zero. Hell yeah! We needed that after last night. Well, at least the Mets are making me happy. At least the Mets can make me happy today. Lindor three run homer and Canha with a single shot. Damn. It's about time our offense finally showed up for the Mets. Are we still missing, um... Marte and uh, McNeil. Probably. I think he said he'd be back for the Cubs. Yeah, we don't have Marte and we don't have McNeil. Damn. Sam says not happy anymore. Why are you not happy? Oh, because you got... You missed out on Marchment. Yeah, Dallas <laughs> slid in on your boy. So, Washington has gotten Darcy Kemper and Charlie Lindgren for goaltending. I love Devils fans. Yeah, this Devils fan on Twitter goes, If I'm Goudreau, do I really want to make the long, frustrating trip to Queens? We don't, we don't play in Queens. The, the Mets play in Queens. We don't, we don't play in Queens. Bro, like, the Islanders don't play in Queens. It's it's not even that bad a trip. I do it all the time. Like, does he not realize the... F and we're about 200 feet from Queens. It's still not like a trip to Queens. Like, anyone who lives on the island knows it's not like a trip to Queens. <laughs> we play next to it. Ooh. It is nothing like going to Queens though. Going through Queens is a whole nother experience. If you- going to City Field and going to UBS are not the same thing. And anyone who's gone to both arenas can attest to that. And yeah, if you want to. I'm gonna sneeze. Oh my god. I've been to City Field. Yeah, Roger, you can say that now. You know what, Jordan? Shut up. <laughs> City Field is an arena, ballpark, whatever you want to freaking call it. <laughs> 
I'm sorry, Sam. You were you were in on Marchment, and then Dallas swooped in and said, "How you doing, boo?" And so there you go, Eric. See, that's a whole different story. And like, you, I mean, Rocha, you saw the trip that we had to do the city field. Not half, not even half as bad. Like. And you saw the traffic we sat in going to city. Not, not even, cl not even close to as bad going to UBS. Like it's cle it's not, not bad at all. I am a game is star. Getting out of the UBS parking lot though, Annie. There's actually better ways and tips and tricks I've learned from going to the games of easy ways to get out of the parking lot. Just easy ways. Uh, one is just literally just waiting. Yes, you're not going to get home as early, I guess. But if you stay, maybe go to the upstairs lounge. Or if you stay and go to um, the uh, Belmont Hall. Um, I've stayed with my friends. And we've just stayed. And we've hung out. We've gotten food after the game. And we've just chilled and had fun. We've talked, maybe talked about the game with other fans there, too. We've gotten into conversations with fans. And we just waited while the other people fought in the parking lots. You just go out after, and there's no fight in the parking lot. You go, there's no fight for the buses. You take the, you take the tram, you go to the parking lot, and you're out. Done. And there was no fight. Like, I would just say wait after the game. Wait for the bus. Like, you know... You know, don't fight for it. I would just say wait. I think it saves you more time. And honestly, less stress. I don't know, Sam. So it says, uh, Trading Nemeth has freed up $2.5 million in cap space for the Rangers. Blackwell to Chicago. Colin Blackwell, two, two years, 1.2 million. Oh. New York Rangers have acquired defenseman Ty Emerson from Arizona in exchange for defenseman Patrick Nemeth, a second round pick and 2025 entry draft. And one future conditional pick. So you gave up a few picks, Jordan. But yeah, so... You got Ty Emerson in exchange for Nemeth, a second round pick in 2025, and a future conditional pick. Yeah, it kind of sucks at UBS with the parking. I know, it, it's a bit of a situation. So, two picks, a, one conditional, one second round, 2025, and Nemeth. To get Ty Emerson. That's the full trade. But yeah. Blackhawks signed Colin Blackwell to two years, 1.2 million. Yes, the new parking garage will be open. Yeah, Joseph, I wouldn't, I mean, they got the, the train will be set up for this year too. That's going to be something completely new with UBS. Uh, the train will be completely set up. I think the train station there is supposed to be fully uh, operational now in 2022-23. So I think, you know, and that shouldn't be a bad ride at all. 
Oscar Lindblom is expected to sign with the Sharks. 2.5 million AAV. So Lindblom will be a San Jose Shark. So they traded. <laughs> Kinda. So Flyers bought him out. Lindblom says, fine, I'm out. See ya. Going to San Jose. I'm gonna go all the way across the damn country. <laughs> hey, what's up, Jimmy? But yeah, so 2.5 million AAV for uh, Limblom and San Jose. Uh, I'm not sure about um, the term. Could be a year. I mean, Limblom's a great player. I think this is a great pickup for San Jose, honestly. Oh, yeah, Joseph. Well, that's not too horrible. But yeah, San Jose has gotten Oscar Lindblom. So I'm going to put that in the thing here. Is it Oscar with a K? I believe so. Uh, I'm gonna put one year for now because it doesn't- it did not tell me term. But yeah. Limblom to San Jose Sharks. Oh, I forgot to put San Jose. Hold on. Yep, Joseph, they've done it. It's just waiting. Waiting to see what Goudreau chooses. Everything's pointing to him going to New Jersey, though. Everything's pointing for him to go to New Jersey, though. Ugh. This is so frustrating, bro. Oh, man. Sitting like this for hours is not good for the spine. <laughs> so not good for the spine. We need, we need good energy. Hold on. Come on. Give the good Uncle Leo energy. <laughs> that gold medal energy. <laughs> yeah. Uh, Canadian sign. Canadians deal, Harry. Oh, yep. Yeah, yeah, okay, you already know. <laughs> uh, Florida Panthers and Nick Cousins with a deal. Chikrin is still on the radar. But Florida Panthers and Nick Cousins have agreed to a two-year, $1.1 million deal. We need to throw a Pokeball at Good <laughs> <laughs> Gotta catch him up. <laughs> I wanna be the very best like no one ever was. <laughs> to catch them is my real test. To train them is my cause. <laughs> I will travel across the- Honestly, it's kind of scary if you think about it, how much the Pokemon theme song kind of correlates with like- Correlates with the- Making it hockey team? <laughs> yes, Grice went to St. Louis. Lekkonen remains with the Avs five-year contract. I know my friend Taylor is stoked about that. But yeah. Lekkonen gets a big extension, I see. Five-year five -year deal. So Lecky will be remaining. Justin Braun and Nick DeSolar. Oh my god, I'm gonna screw that. Are going to Philadelphia. Justin Braun. Philadelphia Flyer. Uh, 
Yeah, Ryoshi, we said that before. <laughs> I love the comments under this. So he put heating Justin Braun and they put, yo, is is point why are he they heating him? Is he cold? <laughs> I just told my friend that uh, Lekkonen's been extended. Yep, Flyers signed their first players. Matt Luff is going to the Red Wings. 